my friends. Oh my goodness. Special day, new planner, special day, new planner. I'm so excited. Ah, this is so exciting. So, da -da -da -da. let's put the cover on and set this baby up. You wanna unbox it with me? This is the Ara Estelle and Annie Plans A5 Complete Weekly Vertical. To my rubber paper, 68 GSM. It is undated and it has a Monday week start, but the months are completely blank. So you could do a Monday or Sunday start. It has a weekly vertical, then grid pages, then another weekly vertical. And then in the back, it has 30 grid pages. How beautiful is this thing with the rose gold? I really wish the planner itself was like this hot pink, but that's because I love pink. I know everybody doesn't just love pink like me, but I'm not going to put tabs because y'all know how I change planners like the wind. So no tabs. I think I would, oh, and it comes with this cute little, look at this comes with this cute little ideas of how you could use the planner and I love that it has yes it has a perpetual like yearly overview as well it came with these little freebie stickers they're like their little product line stickers so we are going to set this baby up I think um, I'm just going to show I'm going to put y'all on like super warp speed and time lapse and set this baby up and then I'll come back at the end to do like a little flip and um, give you my first impressions and let you know a little bit how I plan on using this baby. But this is super exciting. This paper seems very, just off the top of my head, really similar to Stology. If you have a Stology notebook, this paper is incredibly similar. So let me get to setting this up and then I will be back. Okay, wow. So far I'm loving it. What do y'all think? I'm going to write July right here. Oh, this is going to be so perfect. And then this will be August and then the August budget. Oh, I love that. Okay. And then the next thing in here is the weeks. I am going to mark um, where the weeks start. I'm not going to put like monthly tabs, but I am going to put a tab where the weeks start. I am going to set up a spread for the week that we are currently in. I am super excited to start using this. So let me put y'all back on fast forward and set up my week. Oh, 
Okay, this is how it's coming out so far. I need a ruler. I'm gonna make some more dots across here. <laughs> you can hear Emma in the background. She's on the phone with her little friend. So cute. They're so shy at school, but then they get on the phone and just boss each other around. <laughs> Pretty funny. Okay, yellow this time. Because I'm too lazy to look for the forks. Okay, great. So there's the weekly spread done. And then I'm going to show you some more greatness on the back. Oh, I need to put the dates on, but I'll do that later. So behind every week, there's this two-page spread, which is amazing. Um, and this is where I think I can put like a cleaning schedule, a grocery list. Um, what else? Okay, hey, y'all. So um, <laughs> this is the second time I'm filming the end of the video because I got off camera and I just did some thinking. So what I'm thinking is, first of all, I got me this little setup going here which I'm in love with, obviously. Um, got a little card from Notique in here. My little clip from Leslie at Run With Craft Scissors because I adore my hoodies. Picking my kids, washi card, cute little decal <laughs> that I just kept loose. Um, then I have decorated my cover with Connie. Got some more Connie, couple sticky notes, fixed my washi. Got Frank here under the vellum. Okay, then we got the perpetual calendar. Not sure about these pages yet. I'm thinking maybe like a goals section. Not real sure. My monthly behind the month is gonna be my budget for the month. Months continue. Okay, first weekly spread. Um, I added the holiday there, which is Juneteenth, and then next week I'll put July 4th. Um, but behind each of these pages, there is a big um, spread each week. So what I was thinking is, um, I can make, okay, my A6 starting in July. I haven't done anything with the setup yet. What I'm thinking is I'm going to make this just like a big daily to-do list that's kind of decorated up. And that's going to be my A6 planner. It's going to be just like a little list of stuff that I need to do um, each day. Because I love having a daily but on the weekly, I'm going to put each week what I'm reading and then like um, some highlights or like a memory page. Okay, then I'll have another weekly spread. Then I'll have my cleaning um, schedule and a grocery list. Memory spread. What I'm reading, memory spread. Kind of like that. Um, because I do like a big grocery shop like once or twice a month and I tend to stick to like similar items. So I don't need two grocery lists per month. Um, so yeah, this is what I'm thinking for now. So... At the end of the week, um, I will share with y'all when I set up these pages. I think this is gonna be so fun. And then in the back where all these extra pages are, I'm gonna keep those open. I'm gonna make that my holiday section so that when Christmas comes and I wanna make all the lists and all the cute fun spreads, I can put them back there. Um, so I think that that's gonna be the best idea for now. My dog decided to start drinking copious amounts of water. I hope y'all are having a great week so far. Why does this week feel like it's been 50 years long? I don't know. And it's a short week too. Maybe it's because you have to cram like the same amount of work in a short week. Anywho, and it's the first day of summer today as my hubby has said. Um, so second ending to the video. Thank you so much for everything. Um, hit the subscribe button if you want to keep seeing more creative content and I will see you in my next video. Bye.